Sorry about that. Ran out of time again. Uh, so yeah, this is going to be ending shortly. So this is going to be part three. Uh, you know, maybe I should, I don't, I don't know. I'm not sure if this is too in-depth or if I'm just, you know, whatever. But anyway, so I was just showing you guys a loop there. So that's what that is. And if you unselect it, it'll just play right through. So that's, that's the loop. And then, uh, metronome on pre-count on the pre-count is just when you're about to record, it'll play, it'll record, it'll go through two, uh, two bars. So it'll go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and then you record. So that's that. And then, uh, project synchronized setup. I'm not sure if that's kind of like quantizing where it just, uh, gets it all on time. I'm not quite sure on that. Uh, external sync, uh, retrospective, record. Huh. Again, not quite sure. Um, devices, MIDI device manager. It's pretty much like uh, if you have a MIDI controller, that it'll uh, you select it from the MIDI device manager, I think. I'm not, I, I don't have a MIDI controller, so I can tell you. Um, mixer. You can go to your get access your mixer. Uh, because I'm on my laptop, I can't use F3 for some reason. It won't do it. Um, but yeah, you can press F3, or you can go to there. Oh, not there. Here, and you can pick that. Uh, I'll click that, and it'll open up your mixer. And then uh, plug-in information. That just gives you all your VSTs here. If you put in a new VST, uh, new VST plugin and uh, it's not registering here or something just update and it'll uh, update your vsts but it's been it, it, it I'll, I'll i can show you guys actually i already did show you guys in that sr202 that's a prime example of how to import vsti a uh, vst instrument so yeah so um uh let's see then you got your vst connection which is your devices pretty much uh, your VST performance, uh, it's not going to show right now because uh, all, all that does is it pulls up a little bar right here and it kind of looks like, almost like an EQ and it lets you know if it's working or not and it'll actually spike, whatever. Uh, real quick, I'm going to stop this video um, because I'm running short out of time here and I don't want to squish this, you know. So I'll go back to the devices in the next part. So thank you. Uh, I'll be right back.